This video explains how to construct circles in the program Geometer Sketchpad when given a desired radius or diameter length. In our first example, we are constructing a circle with a radius length of 4 centimeters. To start, select the segment tool, which is the fourth button down, and construct any segment. Since we need to have the radius length of 4 centimeters, we have to see if our segment is that desired length. In order to do so, highlight the segment and choose the menu option, Measure Length. And we can see that the length right now is 9.24 centimeters. So I need to make my segment smaller to get the desired length of 4 centimeters. So I'm going to grab one endpoint and condense it. And notice as I condense it or make it smaller, my segment length is also smaller up high there. So I'm going to try to get it to 4. There we go. And our segment length is now 4 centimeters. Now we can make our circle. In order to do that, you're going to select the compass tool, which is the third button down. And you're going to start on the point that you would like to have as your center. All of A is my center. And then I stretch it out until it gets to my other endpoint, point B. I'm going to click. And that's how you construct a circle with the desired radius length. Now what if we had to do a circle that had a diameter length instead of a radius length? In this example, we have to construct a circle that has a diameter that's 8 centimeters. So again, to start, you're going to select the fourth button down, which is the segment tool, and you're going to construct a segment of any length. And then it's already highlighted, and I can go to measure length. And the length of this segment is 10.44, so I have to make it smaller. There we go. So we have a segment of length 8 centimeters. And this is supposed to be the diameter of our circle, so we have to actually find the center of it. And in order to do that, we need to find the midpoint of this segment. So I'm going to highlight the segment that I need to find the midpoint of and go to Construct Midpoint. Okay, so now this is actually going to be the center of our circle. So now we can go to the Compass tool or circle tool and start at our center which is the midpoint and extend to one of our endpoints. And that's how you can construct a circle with the desired diameter length and again also we started off with a desired radius length. I hope you found this video helpful and I hope that you have a good day.